Hello, it's Gare. I have an update on my Arduino VU meter. I have also added a signal indicator. That's the blue light that just flashed. I'm going to test it in a minute. But I'll show you this. The wiring on the Arduino is the same. Pins 2 through 11 go to the LED anodes. The audio signal goes to to pin A0 on the Arduino. <clears throat> and I now have for and now for the signal strength indicator or the um, signal light here. It uses a two N three nine zero four transistor and the blue LED and the same two twenty ohm resistors that the the U meter circuit uses. I know you're all dying to see this in action. So, here you go.
that was the test. Basically, what's making this circuit function? This is my iPod with the YouTube audio library installed on it. That wire goes down to audio input B on my PA system and then output from the PA system goes to this audio jack that I wrap the wires around. The, the pin 1 goes to the base of the 2N3904 and also to the A0 on the Arduino. And the pin 3 goes to the negative rail. I also wanted to talk more about the differences between just a sim simple signal light and a VU meter. A simple audio signal indicator like this one. Look how small it is. That's about the size of it. These are used on smaller devices like headphone amplifiers and and Bluetooth speakers and that sort of thing. Okay. Well, a VU meter may be integrated into devices such as audio bridges, PA systems, larger amplifiers, and the like. In case you're wondering, how is this thing getting power? Look over there. There is a USB power block over behind my Bluetooth speaker. There is a USB power block, which there's a USB cable running into the Arduino, and the breadboard is powered using the 5 volts and common ground from the Arduino. And that's all I have for today. Thank you for watching. Subscribe. Name to me. Goodbye.